Well, lovely people. Right. I thought today I'm going to um, go and pick, do my pick lists, get ready for the Amazon sales and the eBay sales. And I printed off all the labels here. So as you can see, there's labels and tons and tons of pick lists for me to do the packing today. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you what I sell and how much I sell it for. I pick it. So as you can see, I've got this massive wall of batteries, as you can see there. This is basically my what we refer to as my top 200 items of batteries. And then you've got other batteries such as the Ninjas, the Green Cells, and then you've got the crates, which are bigger again. Now, around the back, we've got things like MacBook batteries, and then we have the, the Amazon crates behind the big shelves. Um, these are to be listed. As you can see, it's gone up, 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 up. They're all to be listed. And these are laptop batteries, so Lenovo, we've got Lenovo, Hewlett Packard, Dell, Zeus, etc. etc. Now I'll just go around maybe and just so you can see the place and see what, what I do. Um here this is being broken down. This is going this is the last of the white boxes. I used to have all these used to be white boxes until we replaced it with the uh as they call it now the pick wall. The pick wall is going up again. I'm putting more uh pockets up here and i need to put lights up there but overall it's not too bad so this is our packing table our picking and packing table and as you can see the raw ma mail bag is ready but i'm not going to do that yet i'll go around and you can take a wee view of my place this house i built um oh i've been building it now for the last five six years working through it oh yeah there's there's dell batteries these are new things i'm doing just section one, section two, so I can put flat laptop batteries such as a compatible Dell or, you know, a genuine Dell product. So we can just lift it, see it, lift it, and it's picked up and gone. There's my overflow stock of my Samsung batteries. The, these have to be restocked on a daily basis. One of my biggest sellers. We're only selling them for like three, four pounds each. I mean, it's not major money. So this is the packing room. This is not where I keep all my stock. This is where everything has been listed and it's effectually online for sale. Currently in this room, um, if you add up all the channels, um, such as the five eBay channels, now say that again, three now, because I've closed two down, I've stopped selling on them because they're just wasting my time. So I have three eBay channels, uh, one Amazon and two on buys. Um, and this stock here sort of sort of surmounts to approximately about uh, 300,000 pounds. That's what's in stock. And that's not including the stuff that's to be listed. But let's just go on out and I'll show you the rest of the building. Now, this building here is, is partially constructed. Um, I have um, a house that I've been building quite for a long time now. As you can see, that, see that over there, that's... Milwaukee cases that I've been buying and selling on eBay. They're doing okay. Um, I bought a few more. They came from the fire brigade. I got them from, um, they had changed all their tools from DeWalt, I think, over to Milwaukee and they dumped all the cases and I bought them. Well, not all of them, but I'm still buying them. Um, so this place is more or less the, the, the room between the rooms. Um, I've been building a wee stationary office in here. That's where all my stationery and my packing gear is. Um, and then you've got stock that still has to be listed as well. There's another pile of stock. And this is my sorting room. Now, this room is a complete and utter shambles. As you can see, there's no insulation installed yet here. I've got to move all this out. This is, this is the, this was the first. This used to be my packing room until I got the room on the far side done. But this now is the sorting room. It just simply is a sorting room. So I let you have a scan and see exactly how bad it actually is. This is all stock that I have to still sort. And as you can see, this is all stock that's been sorted. And there's my wee kitty. There's Poppy. Hello, Poppy. So that's that. 
as you can see, lots to do in this room. Um, I'm hoping to get back to construction um, before the winter. I want to get this room done so it's nice and warm for me and the, the staff. Now, I only have a three or four staff working for me. Uh, they do the packing, the picking, the helping me with the other bits and pieces. But I'll just, uh, I'll go downstairs. Now, this is just, as I say, this is the upper part of the house. But I'll go downstairs. These are stairs that I've made myself just until until the floors are set in the main part of the building. Um, there's the Milwaukee cases, as I said. There they are there. And, of course, more stock to go on. That's the Amazon stock. So that's all stock that needs to go on to Amazon. Um, but if you go on down, this is uh, outside of the house, some of the houses, and there's more stock that's come in, not even touched. Um, we tend to buy stock on a weekly basis and we bring it into certain rooms, some for Amazon, uh, some for eBay. So the batteries and the small items, the most go on to eBay. And then the general wear and tear, this is downstairs. This is the downstairs room. It's not even lit properly. Hopefully this week we're going to get new lights installed. But it, it it's where I sort everything. So I put boxes together. I get it all up online. And I just purchase stuff. I recently came into um, a good sale where I can sell rolling papers. Rolling papers. They are doing quite well at the minute. You know, um, loads and loads and loads and loads of rolling papers of that many of them i think it's going to sit there for for years but anyway it doesn't it doesn't uh, go out of date so i'm happy with that but as i go through some of the sections here into the downstairs part of the house i have everything and i mean everything i sell so much not all this is listed um i'm probably not even 30% of my stock is listed purely because it's just time. Um, so I've invested a lot of my own personal money into it. I used to work as an engineer. Before that, I was a retailer. I used to own uh, phone shops, but uh, I decided to change my whole life and decide to go it on my own and try and keep my business down to a minimum of cost and losses and that sort of stuff. So that's that's generally what i have here and there's my little girl hi puppy she follows me around she's like a wee dog aren't you baby so as i said i tend to um i tend to now want to do things a bit lower key than i used to um so ebay makes me a living not much you know i i tend to unfortunately respend anything I earn back into the business. But I enjoy it. Uh, you know, it has its ups and downs, but I enjoy it. Um, so what I'm going to do is in the next video, I'm going to show you a video. I'm going to pick all this stuff, first of all. Um, I'd like to get a slow-mo cam. I might do that, actually go and get a slow-mo cam and do it. But this here um, is uh, going to be a sign of what I do. This is the sort of thing that I do. So I'm going to do a random pick list, get a pick list done, put it out and you can see what I sell. So uh, I'll end this video. Please let, like and subscribe. Uh, any comments, please, you know, as I said, I need help with regards to things. If you see something I'm doing wrong, come on, tell me. I like to improve myself. Um, or if there's anything you'd like or you'd like to see from my business, let me see if I can help you and show you what I do because I don't know what you want to see. Uh, this is I'm new to this business. I'm new to the idea of publicly uh, showing what I do. Um, but I'm inspired by people like uh, Nick and Andrea in England who who I follow quite regularly. And I, I think what they do is quite exciting, actually. Maybe it's just me and that's why I'm doing this video. But like and subscribe with me, guys. Um, and I'll chat to you soon. Good luck.